Hi everyone, I'm your hostess Sarah Viteri and welcome to this year's Marine 2021 Boat Show live event. I'd love to give a huge shout out to everyone who made it here in person today and to everyone at home watching live. This is our first virtual event at Highway Marine and we couldn't be more excited to share this experience with all of you today. Day. Highway Marine is known for their incredible selection of high quality new and used boats by top rated marine industry brands. Their remarkable service and repair options and their excellent customer service. But it's not every day that you get to see what happens behind the scenes or hear boating tips from their expert staff, right? Well, the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show has all of that and more. We're talking interviews, tutorials, showroom tours, and Q&As. You're not going to want to miss one minute of this show. And don't forget to also tune in for our final live event on Sunday, March 28, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Join us virtually by visiting hmboatshow.com. We also invite you to sign up for a time when you can stop by for the show in person. Why not see these boats for yourself? Just head over to hmboatshow.com and fill out the form. We are following CDC social distancing guidelines, so that's why it's important to claim your spot now. Do not wait. They go fast. And we also have a grand prize giveaway. Woo! We'll be announcing the winner of a Yamaha Sea Scooter Explorer on the 28th at 3 p.m. during our final live streaming show. So... Who's excited for this year's Highway Marine Boat Show? They're excited, people. <laughs> We've got some really fun things planned for the day. We have boat tours, DIYs, so many things for us for you to join us. So please um, join us today at Highway Marine Boat Show 2021. And you can also, you the viewer, can join us live on air by dialing 570 417-7209. The Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show live event starts now. Hi folks, Andy Paradise here. I'm the sales manager at Highway Marine. Wanted to talk to you a minute about COVID safety. Um, we are very sensitive to your safety as well as the employees here at Highway Marine. We do um, have hand sanitizing stations throughout the store and we do require that you mask up when you come in and we always try our best to uh, have safe social distancing between ourselves and all of our customers. Please come in. We'll make you as comfortable as it can possibly be. Boat lovers, jet ski thrill seekers, open water voyagers, and navigation experts, welcome. We're Highway Marine. We are proud providers of high quality, new and used boats by top rated marine industry brands. With selections from Yamaha, Crestliner, Hurricane, Sea Fox, and Sea Water. If you love time spent on the open water, Highway Marine is for you. Whether it's your first time out there or you're a seasoned pro, our 30-person okay, team of boating so experts is dedicated here? to helping you navigate on your next boating adventure. We're a family-owned uh, business and focused on perfection in sales, Ruthie, service, are we and getting customer them here? satisfaction. The interviews are next. Okay, Highway are we Marine starting has with a 16-acre facility where we cater to every boater's needs. 
Our boat repair so, and service department employs certified technicians with state-of-the-art diagnostic Georgia. equipment for top-of-the-line <gasps> boat and motor Kimberly. maintenance and repair, allowing Hi. us to easily manage boat hauling, detailing, fiberglass repairs, engine rebuilds, and storage. Our sales department is filled with power boat specialists who are eager to work with your budgeting needs and boating desires. We even have a boat accessories department that is one of the largest in the area, providing discounted prices every day. The best part? We have a state-of-the-art showroom with over 35 new and incredible boats to browse. Pay us a visit and join the Highway Marine family of proud owners because you deserve the perfect boating experience. Stop by Highway Marine at 875 Northwest End Boulevard, Quakertown, PA. Visit highwaymarine.com or give us a call at 215-536-4721 to find out more about our incredible services and offerings. You owe it to yourself to see these new and used boats and pontoons firsthand. Boat lovers, jet ski thrill seekers. Welcome boat. back to the Highway Marine Boat Show 2021. And we have with us today, come on over, Dustin and Jessica. We're on day number five of the boat show. So tell us, how is the event going so far? It's going great. Uh, definitely come down and ch take a look at uh, all the boats we have in stock. Uh, they're getting limited, so uh, you always can put a, a deposit down on a 2022, though. And how are you feeling about the boat show, Jessica? I think it's going great so far. I think um, a lot of people are enjoying it. The kids are coming out, and um, we have kits for them. Um, we also have some prizes that we've been giving away. So if you've done your scratch-off game, come out and collect your gift card. Um, we do have those here. So I think everybody's enjoying it and getting excited to get out on the water. And I think we have a little pet visitor today, Georgia, and she's excited too. And now you guys are so good at your job, such experts on the needs when people come in. So for somebody like me, who's a newbie, who doesn't really know too much about boats, if I were to come in and buy a boat, what boat would you recommend for me? And I'm by myself, just my puppy, but have tons of friends. Um, it all depends where you're going to use it, but um, I'd probably recommend a Yamaha jet boat for somebody new. It's uh, They got a low draft and... Uh, there's no uh, propellers back there, so it's safe for uh, the whole family. Oh, I like that. Would you recommend a little something a little bit different? I don't know. I like the pontoons if you're wanting to party with your friends. Dogs are good for that, so either one. <laughs> and I do like that they do have an option that you can control your music, right? Even though if you're lounging in the pool in one of the pontoons? Yes, definitely. That is the bow for me. <laughs> Jessica sold me. <laughs> um, and it's safe for dogs. Are all boats generally safe for puppies? I would think so. Yes. <laughs> okay, cool. That's good to know. All right, thank you guys. If you have any other questions, please join us at 570-417-720 now and share your boat stories. We want to hear from you. Many have tried but none compare to Yamaha's marine engine's unbeatable reliability, durability, and unparalleled performance. Go with the engine that is built on 65 years of marine heritage. And trust your family memories to a legend. Expertly crafted by the number one brand on the water, This month at Highway Marine, get a new Yamaha boat and take advantage of Yamaha's zero, zero offer. That's zero down and zero payments for 90 days or choose 2.99% APR financing for up to 60 months. In the market for a new Yamaha Wave Runner, the same great zero, zero offer applies. That's zero down and zero payments for up to 90 days or choose 3.99% APR financing for up to 36 months. Highway Marine also has rebates up to $1,500 on Mercury Outboard Motors from 175 to 400 horsepower. Take advantage of these offers and more at Highway Marine in Quakertown, Pennsylvania.
Welcome back. Up next, we have some fun trivia, and we have Dave. Are you ready for some trivia fun? I um, hope so, yes. And do you, are you a customer here at Highway Marine? Uh, yes, today. Mm -hmm. Just today, so let's see what he ends up getting. Okay, Dave, can you tell us how fast a Yamaha 275 series boats go? I'm going to guess 52 miles an hour. That was very close. The answer is 50 miles per hour. Woohoo! Dave's off to a great start. Our next question, in what year did engineers begin development for the first Yamaha outboard motor? I'm going to say 1961. Again, super close. 1958 is the correct answer. And where were hurricane deck boats first made? Uh, Indianapolis, Indiana. Elkhart, Indiana. Dave, I hope we have something lined up for him because he's getting them very, very close. If they were manufactured for over 45 years in Elkhart, Indiana. And how many boats are owned by Americans today? Oh, uh, 2.5 million. That wasn't even close. Folks, it is 18 million, 18 million Americans own boats today. And what, Highway Marines only like half of that, maybe yeah. more? <laughs> so I hope you're enjoying today and your experience here at the boat show. Yes. How's the Highway Marine family treating you? Oh, very good, very good, very knowledgeable. Nice, oh. nice facility. I'm glad, I'm glad. Well, thank you so much, Dave. You're Go welcome. ahead and thank you so much, production. They'll, they'll give you a little something because he was really close. And up next, we have Greg for a few more trivia questions. Greg, come on over, don't be shy. The people wanna hear from you. So, Do you, need you ready for some trivia? Yeah, I'll try. Are you enjoying the boat show so far? Um, yes. Just, yeah. just got here. So it's, uh, well, welcome. <laughs> so, when someone asks, how much does she draw, they want to know your boat's draft. Very good. We got some knowledgeable people on here today. Um, so, production, make sure you, you get a little gift for them. So, next question. What is the name of the process where you join or connect a rope or ropes by interweaving the strands at the ends. Actually, I don't know that. Oh, we, 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 we caught you there. It's called the splice. Okay. So I, we don't expect you to know that, but the people here at Highway Marine are super knowledgeable. And I'm sure they'll take you through everything you need to know boat-wise. Our next question, who invented the pontoon boat? <laughs> Stumped. Ambrose Weirs. Cheers to Ambrose because apparently that's the boat I should be getting to party with my friends. Thank you so much, Greg. I All hope right. you enjoy the show and you find the boat you're looking for. Thank you, folks. We'll be back shortly. Welcome to Highway Marine. Today I am here with Dustin, who's going to give me a little tour room. Right here, we're standing in between some really cool looking wave runners. So tell me a little bit about these. Yeah, we carry uh, Yamaha's full line of wave runners here, um, anywhere from their EX to VX to their FX cruiser line. Okay, that's a lot of VXs. It would be this FX uh, gray and yellow one right here behind you. This one, and it looks really cool too. And how fast does it go? Right about 70 mile an hour. Okay, and with that, that's the one I'm buying. So save that one for me, Dustin. Show me around the rest of this uh, wonderful showroom. Yeah, absolutely. What else do we have? We uh, have a Sea Fox uh, center console line over here. Okay. Uh, great for uh, offshore fishing. Okay, I haven't gone fishing, so you're gonna have to show me around <laughs> that. Um, and what is this here, this black and green boat? This is Yamaha's jet boat. This is a 252X. It's uh, made for uh, wakeboarding, you know, family and fun. Oh, family fun. And why would you recommend this to a family? Um, the biggest thing is it has no propellers and it's, it's great. It doesn't have, draft a lot of water. So. Yeah, absolutely. For the kids. Yep. Okay, great. And this lovely gray boat, what is this about? This is our Crestliner aluminum fishing boat. Uh, great for any lakes around here and um, good for fishermen. Great. So you have your fishermen, you have your family fun, you can go fast, you can play around, and then you have some pontoon boats. What do you recommend um, 
for the pontoon boats for family, for fun, for it all? Yeah, uh, Godfrey is our pontoon line we sell. Um, they've, they've come a long way years. Um, they're great. They have a lot of uh, space. So it's uh, great for um, you know, bringing your family, your pets. All pets. Like that. So it's safe for dogs which is something I'm interested in because I take my dog everywhere. And from what I hear is you can have a pontoon that'll be easy in the water and ones that will go really fast. Yeah, it's anywhere from 16 to 25 foot. Uh, some have uh, three tunes, so it's a, a tri-tune. Um, a lot more sportier and faster. Okay, that's where I'm headed. And what do we have here, 150 Pro? Yep, that's our uh, Mercury on our Crestliner fish here. It's a... Uh, you can um, do fishing and also uh, pull tubes and uh, have fun with your kids on it. And what's the difference between this one and that one, the other Mercury? Um, it's actually, uh, the Mercury, it's, it's a little bit different horsepower um, okay. and the size of the boat. Gotcha. Okay, what else? You have a big showroom <laughs> and with all these boats that you sell, I'm sure that at some point they need maintenance. Do you guys offer that here? Yeah, absolutely. We have an 18 bay service uh, area in the back. Uh, we do anything from winterization to your random uh, service. Um, okay. Done for you. So you can buy the boats here and then come and get it serviced all under one roof at Howie Marine. Um, I just love what you have to offer. You have something for everybody. Really luxurious pontoon boats that. I want to go check out. So come on, let's go. Yep. We're not going to show you guys. <gasps> Look at this. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. And we are here with Stephen, who's going to walk us through this beautiful, beautiful, I can say beautiful, Yamaha. So tell us about this. There's so many great features. Tell the people why they should buy one. Well, number one, styling. Also, draft. Um, dead rise. There's a lot of integrated features into this boat. We don't really have to add anything to it. Um, you've got fly-by-wire uh, throttle, you've got your stern lounge and why, area. And why would the fly-by-wire throttle be important? Well, it allows for digital gauging, also very smooth transition into gears. Okay. Um, very functional, and you can do add-ons with that throttle as well. Well, that's something that definitely people need to know about. And tell us, what else do we have here? We have our 12.3 Connect system here. This is going to tell you everything under the sun, what's going on with your boat. As far as uh, gallons per hour used, uh, trips, you can also program skier modes in there. There's a lot of good stuff going on in the Connects. You also have Great. integrated maps in there for GPS. I'm not sure how many, but there's some in there. <laughs> <laughs> and does it memorize any of your favorite routes? Uh, it does for waypoints. You have to go to a route, mark, and then it'll take you back. That's wonderful. And there's an integrated ballast system. Tell us about that. How does that work? How the ballast system works is it's basically incorporated into the whole of the boat. Okay. So that is going to allow you to fill the ballast system with water and get more weight for more wake. If you're wake, uh, doing any wakeboarding, wake surfing, wake skating, that kind of stuff. All the good stuff. And the custom marine mats, tell us about those. Why are they so important? The mats? The custom marine mats. Okay, the, the sea deck is easier on your feet, doesn't really hold the heat, uh, very easy to clean, it's impervious, to uh, it's water resistant, impervious to mold and mildew, that kind of stuff. Well, that's really good to know. We don't want us burning our feet Absolutely. and we don't want to get, catch too many sun rays. <laughs> so that's what this bimini yes. top is for, correct? Yes, the bimini top is for shade. You can always pop in and out if you want to get some sun. One nice feature to this Bimini top is you have a zipper here, so when you are wakeboarding and doing your wake sports, you're connected up here, rope runs through the uh, zipper, and you can keep your Bimini top open, which That's is very unique to, to Yamaha. That's awesome, and I know a lot of us need that, especially if we were trying to stay away from the sun. I know I have a friend who constantly needs to have her hat on, and yeah, that's great to know. And the cockpit fold-out table, it's right over here, it just folds out. There is a fold-out table here, which is new for the 2021 models. Just pull that backrest, flip this up, connect it there, and you have yourself a little serving station. 
additional storage here. Love also it. a uh, dedicated spot for your cooler there. So you have your spot for your cooler, your storage, have your drink, and have some lunch. Exactly. Thank you so much, Steven. So as Very you well, guys you go. know, come see us here. See this Yamaha 252 for yourself. Highway Marine Boat Show 2021 will continue shortly after this. Thanks, guys. Welcome to the summer of riding high and laying low. Yamaha's most versatile wake boats on the market deliver all the wake surf action you crave. With a spacious interior to help you relax in style. Everything you need to elevate your wake surf excitement comes standard. And the award-winning Connext touchscreen delivers a customizable wake experience for every skill level. The new 2021 Yamaha Wake Series is decked out with a premium sound system. And cutting edge technology, including the drive dual paddle control system that provides ultimate enjoyment season after season. sacrifices, no compromises, no apologies. Mercury V8 and V6 outboards deliver everything you need to go boldly. Twenty years ago, Seafox Boat Company began with a clear governing philosophy at heart to develop and build quality handcrafted saltwater boats. While a whole lot has changed in the materials and the methods of building boats during the past two decades, Seafox remains committed with a passion and purpose to perfecting the ability to offer our customers the finest boats for the fairest price. Today, Seafox has grown to become one of the nation's leading manufacturers of saltwater boats, offering you a full line of diverse designs, center consoles, bay boats, side consoles, and dual consoles. All are paired with a multitude of leading edge technology and innovative features that are unmatched in the industry. Whether you enjoy inshore or offshore fishing, cruising or wakeboarding, Seafox has the right boat model to exceed your expectations. Welcome back. Don't forget, this show is live and interactive. You, the viewer, can call in and join us live on air by calling the number on your screen, 570-417-7209. In a little while, we will be asking you to share your wildest fishing stories, and later we'll have some more fun trivia. You can also call in with any questions about the many awesome boats featured here on the Highway Marines showroom floor. So please don't forget to call and join us live. I want to hear from you. I want to hear your fishing stories and we want to answer your questions. And we'll be back with some fish tales. Hi guys, I'm Bob and this is Lori. Good morning. And today we're sitting in the bow of the Sun Deck 235 outboard. Now this is one of our newer boats oh, in the five lineup. Minutes. We brought this boat out last <laughs> year. Better. This was a completely white sheet of paper boat from the keel up. It's all brand new and it's just outstanding. There's so many features in it. We're going to tell you a few of them this morning. One of the things that you'll notice immediately is the width in the front of this boat. you got rear facing pads. Lori and I can barely touch our arms when we're sitting here. It's got a lot of room. Real long bow in it. Tons of storage space up front. Great live well cooler combination here. Really nice integrated bow anchor locker here in the front with your ladder, of course, all stainless steel. 
This is a deeper boat. The first thing you'll notice about the 235 is you're sitting down in the boat. Well, the design process to this boat was to build a boat that was designed for a little bit heavier water than the normal hurricane. So we wanted high sides on it, we wanted a different running surface on the boat. We wanted to make sure the boat would perform with the 150 as the base motor on it, and it does a great job with it. It's a tremendous design on the boat. It's one of the best new boats we've done in a long time. So let's show you a couple of other features as we move to the back of the boat, all right, Lori? Lori, these are really great helm seats. Can you tell me about these? Yes, what I like on this interior is that both the captain and the co-captain side have the flip, so you can sit facing forward, or oh, nice. if you're looking to have a little bit more leg room and look out the rear, you're able to do that as well. This is our sport gray, and then it, the color option is called our coordinate gray. You can also have a bolster added to the captain's seat, which is a nice feature and actually new for 2021. I like that. Plus, I like the fact that the whole seat slides. Yes, so depending on if you have longer legs or maybe you uh, are have a little bit shorter legs, you're able to get the seat just to where you need to be comfortable for driving the boat. And again, this helm looks, looks really well laid out. It's got the fusion system on it. and This has got new gauges for this year, correct? Correct. For 2021, Hurricane worked hard, our designers, to come up with new gauges that are both functional as well as nice to look at and easy to read. So we're excited to have those out on the water this year. Another thing you'll notice is being a windshield boat, this boat does right. have an optional two-piece cover that comes with it. So we can close this off. We've got a great dodge there... door here that opens up. Oh, they're coming. It closes okay, cool. the front area off, makes this wind a little bit more wind How resistant. How long is this one? You can leave the bow one? on. You can have the back open, we can close Three the minutes. window, and we can go out in a little bit colder weather. Mm -hmm. This boat's been doing very well in the Northeast in Thanks. those different climates, um, other than those hot tropical areas that we sell a lot in. Really well designed, and we've got a porta potty in this. We've got a really Let nice change room porta potty in this, Graphic. which you don't normally find in a boat this size, but that's a nice mm -hmm. feature, especially for someone with a family. Two of the things that I look for most when I'm checking out boats cup holders and then storage, storage, storage. So you have not only under the seat, but you have under the helm as well as some great storage underneath in the floor. And then again, with the cup holder design that we have in this model, we purposely kept them nice, simple, and easy to clean. On this model, we also have the telescoping ski tow. What's nice about that is that when you're towing the kids, you're able to have it up and get the use out of it. And yet, if you're just doing a cruise with friends, you're able to take it down and take it out of the way. Also featured on our Sun Deck 235 OB, with this seat, as you can see, there's just a little bit of shape to the foam. It really does help curve your body, makes it a comfortable place to sit. Five, seven. And what I like is additional wet storage oh, cool. under this seat. Thank you. So plenty of room for you to throw in a bag of ice and pack your beverages for your outing. And as we showed before, this is really nice to move back and forth for whichever way you need to face. Featured on this model then is our preferred option group, which gives you the stern washdown, as well as dual battery switch, and then it does come with a boat cover. And like is how much space you do have back here. Plenty of room if you want to sit to put your ski on or put on your wakeboard before you jump in the water. And then it's easy enough to step from port to starboard and get around your engine. Lori, this is striking. This new Hyper Blue is just gorgeous. I really like the optional deck and hull graphics. They really work out well. You can see from the side of this boat that it is a very deep boat for a hurricane. It was, as I said, it was designed for bigger water use. That being said, this, can, this boat can take up to a 200 horse and 12 people, and it's got to have a big fuel tank in it, right, Lori? 52 gallons for you. 52 gallons of fuel in a hurricane this size is amazing. You're going to go out all day in this boat. You're going to get into some areas with okay. a hurricane that you've never been able to get into. It's really designed for coastal, those freshwater lakes, Great Lakes areas like that. It really, really is a wonderful boat. It's a great size for a lot of families without getting into a massive big boat. This is an eight and a half foot boat. It just is a perfect length, it's trailerable, and yet it gives you that big water ride. So this is the Hurricane Sun Deck 235 Outboard. We appreciate you looking at it.
Welcome back to the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show here in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. Up next, we have a couple that's going to give us some of their fish stories. Remember, we want to hear from you guys at home as well. 570-417-7209. Let's hear your boating stories, your fish stories, or if you have any questions, we will answer them for you. Right here we have Greg and Kim. Hi guys, welcome. So, I've been told that you have some fish stories for us or boating stories. Tell us something. Okay. Well, we go to Maine every summer. Okay. And we visit family. And we also have family that comes in from Denmark. And they like to do some fishing. So, Greg has a boat and they went out for a, uh, a fishing trip and had a very wild time. I'll let him go. Oh, wild time. Tell us about your wild time. People at home want to know. <laughs> well, it, it was low tide and usually I wouldn't go during low tide. But... We had the time to go, so we went. I took my cousin's husband from Denmark and his son, and we went to the, the harbor up in Maine to go out and troll around a little bit. And uh, so we, we set, got set up, and we went out, and we were trolling out of the inlet, and we turned to come back on the opposite side, and a wave came from behind all of a sudden, um, and the wave hit the backside of my boat and was almost pushing it and my my cousin's husband's a really big guy so so the the boat was starting to list to one side oh my and i'm at the the edge of my seat right now the neck what happened well i mean the water is 51 degrees up there it was in the summer yeah but it was still cold yeah and all of a sudden he goes off the back of the boat and he's in the water and you know we have these breakers coming and so i tried to turn the boat around because i have all these lines out and, and I, that's not easy to no do. and i so i didn't want to hook him so i, oh I finally God. i did I'm turn sorry. around i did turn around and we threw him a life preserver well, his son was on the boat also so he was helping Greg right. while his father was in the water oh my god right so he, and, and, and i would have gone into panic mode did you go into were you a little panic or you went straight into survival mode well, we had to do what we had. To, we tried to, to get away from him right away with the Ooh. lines because I don't want, you know, didn't want to hook him. Oh. And so we turned the boat and, and we had to go out a little bit. He had a life preserver and he was starting to swim. And he, he doesn't panic. He's, he's a very calm guy. So uh, That's good. He, ju- he just started to, to, I could see him paddling in like he had a little Get raft. Fish part. <laughs> and so we turned and I told my my cousin's son to, to reel the lines up we got to get these lines up right away we got to go back and get your father and we were watching him he was fine but um like he couldn't get the, the line up so i finally i got away from some of the breakers enough so that i was trying to reel it up myself and i, I couldn't and finally you got him up i did because i had a big striper on the line so we throw the big fish we throw the striper in the boat get your your father let's get him let's get him but we, by then on. we could see that the, the people on the on the jetties already had saw all this take place and the harbor boat was already to him to pick him up because it was only like a, a half a mile in from where we left so we, we pick him up and we go back to the dock and and uh i'm getting the boat ready to take out of the water and my cousin goes why are we going in and I was like, are you kidding me? I'm, I mean, would you, would you know how bad this could have been? You go, yes. I thought he, he fell yes. off. He did. He jumped off. And I think that was really smart. Right. And you were a hero. Thank you so much for sharing and that. Deeper striper, too. And we had fish for, for dinner. For dinner. I so, said, we're going in <laughs> and we're going to have this. You saved dinner. a man. You got some fish. That is one heck of a story. Please call in. I want to hear more of these stories. 570-417-7209. I want to hear your stories. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that. Hero and fisherman. <laughs> Talk story. to you guys soon. for people to give back to the community, give back.
back to the services as well. We're volunteers, but we make a difference. We help out the uh, active side in augmenting their forces, and we get to do jobs side by side with them and help them out. chef program in the galley to uh, the comms watchstander in the watch room and then uh, they're also a great uh, asset for helping us train for our mission going out there to do uh, as a safety platform and also giving us a different type of platform to train on and learn how to tow boats. I would say there are so many opportunities within the Coast Guard Auxiliary to assist the Coast Guard uh, it's a volunteer organization and we can do so many things aside from our contributions because we have such a wide, diverse background. program's great. I mean, I've, I've seen some magnificent food come from the auxiliary, uh, some replica cakes of Coast Guard vessels, and then uh, also just the, the quality of food is great. person that puts on the auxiliary uniform, you know, is there to support the Coast Guard. And I think that's part of the, our strength is having the auxiliary force. the different types of job opportunities, career opportunities that are available, and then choose wisely. Other service organizations may offer you some interesting things to do, but the Coast Guard Auxiliary offers you possibly the most. But if you want to examine vessels, it's you, to make sure that they have the right safety equipment. If you want to train people on how to be safe when they're out on their boats or their kayaks. If you want to, if you want to uh, be on a vessel and, and uh, go out and make sure people are safe on the water, this is the organization for you. Uh, what they do on a day-to-day -day basis. They are a force multiplier for the Coast Guard, uh, whether it be aviation or surface side. I, I think the auxiliary is going to continue to grow. 
I don't think the Coast Guard can do what we do without the auxiliary. Hi everyone, welcome back to Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show. Make sure you come out and see these beautiful boats that we have for sale. Inventory is going really quick. We want to see you out here. And who do we have here? Scott. Scott, and you work here at Highway Marine? Uh, correct, yeah, I'm in sales. And how is the boat show going so far for you? Uh, swimmingly. No swimmingly. Pun intended. And um, what would you tell to the people that are looking to get on the lake this season? Uh, I would highly encourage people to get here sooner than later. Um, we put a significant dent in our 2021 inventory uh, already. Um, we are also taking uh, deposits on 2022 models right now. Fingers crossed we'll have those before the end of summer. But, um, you know, if you want to get on the water this year, I, I would recommend coming here as soon as possible. Right now. Right like, now. Get over here. Go to Highway Marine. Make sure you, uh, you, you RSVP. I can't even talk. RSVP so you can come out in person and talk to one of these wonderful salespeople. So if somebody were to come in with a family, um, two kids, husband, wife, and a dog, what kind of boat would you recommend for them? Um, I mean, there's a number of different ways you can go. I would say a pontoon boat might be uh, a good route to go. Um, they're, it's basically like a, a patio on the water, um, family friendly, uh, if you know, taking dogs, uh, it's, uh, you know, they have a gate in the front and the back to kind of keep everybody contained. Uh, that would be a good option. Another option would be, uh, one of our bow riders. Um, same thing, you know, eight, eight to 10 people, um, uh, just a general all purpose boat. I mean, not something specifically for fishing or whatnot, but, uh, to get on the water, right. I'd say, yeah, like a bow rider or a pontoon. That's what Jessica recommended. I get one. So I'm assuming we should all get one. <laughs> you should all get one. You can take the whole crew on one. Uh, so apart from being a wonderful salesman and having a great inventory here at Highway Marine, tell us about your service department. Our service department second to none. Um, some of the guys in the shop have been with us for over 25 years. Um, we have 16 bays. Uh, all mechanics are an absolute wealth of information. I mean, you couldn't be in better hands. I trust those guys with my life. Oh, well, he will trust his wife around them, so that means bring oh. your wives in. No, 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 no. <laughs> I trust them with my life. With your life. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. But no, it, 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 they're, they're, they're fantastic. I mean, it, it's, um, you know, spring and fall are two busiest seasons back there. Uh, obviously, with, you know, spring starts, people want to get their boats back on the water, and then the fall, the rush comes back. Everybody wants to get, you know, buttoned up for wintertime. So right. we have enough people to get you, uh, get you in and out in a reasonable amount of time. Thank you so much, Scott. I appreciate your time. So come in, see Scott, get your boat, get on the lake for this summer. Thank you, Scott. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> and next, I think we have Beth coming up. Where's Beth? Beth. Hi, Beth. How are you? Hi, Beth. So you're here attending the show. How's your experience so far? Oh, very nice. Very nice. Four years ago, we came up for the show and we bought a boat. And how's been the service? Oh, the service is excellent. They put it in the water every year for us. They bring it out. They service it. They get it ready. They put it back in the water for us. And everything has always been excellent. I mean, that sounds like excellent customer service. Come out. Have the same experience as Beth. And what is it that you like about Highways Marine aside from other competitors? Or is this the only uh, boat showroom that you've been to? This is the only boat place that we've been to and we've just been very very pleased uh like i said this is our fourth year of having our boat they've put it in the water they've taken it out they've done all the servicing when we had one time we had a dead battery and stan came all the way out and charged our battery for us gave us extra instructions on how to use the boats because my husband was afraid he was going to hit another boat mm. and i can't speak highly enough of the experience that we've had here 
That's wonderful. Last time I was here, they were telling me how they even give their personal cell phone numbers to you so you can reach out to them. These salesmen are excellent. They treat you like family. Come out to Highway Marine in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. The boat show is still going on 2021 and we're doing it live for you guys to see just how wonderful everybody's experience is here at Highway Marine. Thank you so much, Beth. I appreciate your story. Please call us. We're still taking calls. We want to hear your boat stories. We want to see if you have questions. 570-417-7209. We'll be back shortly. Hey folks, I'm Joe Moore with Highway Marine. You know, whether you're planning a fun trip on the water, fun fishing, whether you're planning on fishing a tournament, it's really, really important to go over all the safety features on your boat and make sure everything you want is on the boat and organized exactly where you need it to be. This is my personal 1600 Crestliner Storm. I want to show you what I do. Your homework starts the night before your trip. You always want to check your safety components before your boat ever leaves your storage. We'll start by making sure that our tilt works. Perfect. Make sure that our navigation lights work. Those are on. Fronts are on. Perfect. Anchor light works. Make sure the bilge works. Just turn it on for a second, listen for it. And if you're fishing a tournament in particular, you want to make sure that your live will pump in your aerator function. Awesome. It's also a really good idea if you have quality electronics like this Garmin unit here, take a look at the map of the lake you plan on fishing. Maybe drop some waypoints on some hot spots, some areas you plan on fishing. Or if you're fishing a tournament, maybe go back in your history and look at some areas from about that time of year where you've had success in the past. And while it sure is nice to have a big 20, 21 foot bass boat, whether you're fishing horsepower restricted lakes like I do, or maybe your budget dictates a little bit of a smaller boat, boats like this 1600 Storm offer a ton of value for the everyday angler. There's ample storage for all my tackle, my rods, and all my safety equipment, as well as my tools. I want to show you how I keep my boat organized. Let's start up here in the front. Now, this compartment here looks like a small hatch but on the inside, it's got tons and tons of room for storage. This compartment here is where I keep all of my soft plastics organized in these small 427 Plano boxes. I've got one particular type of plastic for every single box that I have. This one in particular happens to hold my striking rodents. I've got them all organized by color. And I can carry every single plastic bait that I think I'm going to use, and maybe even some that I'm not sure I'm going to use, but it sure is nice to have. All these boxes came out of this one little compartment. It's also important to keep your terminal tackle organized. I have all my jig heads in little boxes like these fray bills. It's important to make sure that you know where all of your tackle is, especially in a tournament situation. What you don't want to happen is you don't want to forget where you place something and you need something very, very important before you make your next cast. That's just wasted time on the water. And this is where I like to keep all my hard baits. If there's a particular crankbait, jerkbait, a topwater, even a frog that I need, I know I can find it in this compartment here. Now, similar to that front storage compartment, this lid isn't all that big, and it may fool you that this might be a smaller size compartment, but I guarantee you, there's a ton of space in here. I can fit about a dozen of these full-size 3,700 flambeau-sized tackle boxes in here. I've got all my hard baits. I have too much tackle, I know, but I'm sure you can all relate to that. Now, besides all my hard baits, this is also the compartment that I keep an extra set of clothes, my rain gear, as well as some electronics accessories. You always want to bring with you a dry sweatshirt, a windbreaker jacket, and for those nasty days where the wind and the rain are falling, a good quality rainproof poncho and bib set. 
Now underneath the driver's seat here, which folds forward for additional storage, this is where I keep my basic toolbox. I've got everything in here from a pair of needle nose pliers to deal with deeply hooked fish, a Sharpie marker for coloring my fishing line. Maybe I shouldn't say that one too loud. I've got electrical tape. I even have some solution here for cleaning off my Garmin screens for a better view. All of these components and more I keep in this really convenient little tote with a snap-on lid that fits right underneath my seat. I also keep some other safety gear in here, such as a fire extinguisher, some dock lines, some marker buoys, and other things that I always bring with me and never leave home without. Now over here under this big hatch is my live well. When I'm not fishing tournaments, I simply use this to store my life jackets, and maybe a coal beam and some culling equipment for my tournament fishing. But one thing I want to mention is this live well is absolutely huge, especially for a 16-foot boat. If you compare the size of the live well on a 1600 Storm to other 16-foot class bass boats, I think you'd be pretty surprised. Now, onto the pride and joy of every bass fisherman, the rod locker. Now, if you read Crestliner's brochure on this particular boat, You'll see they say you can hold about four rods up to eight feet long in this rod locker. Well, if you take a peek in here, I've got 10 full-size bass setups right now. I suggest that if you were to put more than about half a dozen rods in this rod locker, you invest in some quality rod sleeves like these rod warriors here to prevent them from being broken, scratched, or even tangling with other rods in your rod box. Now I admit, I carry way too many rods and way too much tackle with me, even if I'm not competing. But luckily for me, my 1600 Storm has plenty of storage space and fishes just like a much bigger boat. Come check out the 2021 models we have here at Highway Marine in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. Welcome back to Highway Marine 2021 Live Boat Show. And I am here with Andy, salesman and manager extraordinaire. <laughs> he has so much crucial information. I've learned so much. Thank you, Andy. And we are here back at this beautiful Yamaha 252XE. And we're going to talk about this all-in-one touchscreen helm control system that integrates the boat's entertainment features, operation functions, and essential system information. Sounds like a big deal. Tell us about it, Andy. Hi, thanks. Um, I know Stephen uh, went through the boat, but I wanted to go through a little bit about this Connect system. This is an award-winning dashboard from Yamaha. It's very unique completely gear glare proof and as you notice there are no gauges on this boat at all Ooh. everything is on this touch 12.3 inches uh, diagonal in diameter um, everything you want on the boat is here everything from your initial diagnostics which is water temperature which is very important if you're skiing or, uh, or wakeboarding um, all of your stereo settings um, I love 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 the GPS chart plotter that is on there it tells you where you've been where you're going I and like uh, you can load in any particular waterway that you're going to be in. General diagnostics, economy, how long you've been, um, how much fuel is left so you can get at home. <laughs> um, uh, the X boat means um, uh, it is a wake boat, so this gives you the controls to bring in 1,100 pounds of water inside the boat to create a large wake. There are three ballast tanks on this. You can control filling them and you control uh, the water leaving it. And then of course, you have the uh, actual picture of the boat and when you turn on the navigation lights, it actually lights up, which are on right now Ooh. on this boat. And because it is an e-boat, which is fly-by-wire, which means it's electronic shifting, you can actually press that button right there and that will let you shift and uh, throttle with one throttle instead of two. 
Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> and uh, it has great boat diagnostics, I see there. So you can see the maintenance. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, um, the diagnostics are, are really your economy. Um, you constantly have depth and fuel on the boat that's telling you exactly how much you have left. But your tachometer and your gallons per hour, and again, how much fuel you're using and how much fuel you have left so you can always get back to port without any issues at all. And most importantly, stereo system that's stereo. on the boat as well. That's super important. Yeah. Yeah. You won my heart, Andy. <laughs> as you guys can see, state-of-the-art 12.3-inch display, super, super technology, keeps you safe, keeps you in the water as long as you have gas. <laughs> thank you guys so much. We will be back after a few words, but thank you, Andy. You're welcome. We're here at Thanks the Highway Marine. Again. We're 2021 Boat Show Live. <laughs> Welcome back. And how we have, who do we have with uh, us? Andrew Brunsinger with Highway Marine. And you are a salesman here at Highway Marine. Correct, yes. We are so excited to be walking through this Hurricane 217 deck boat. So tell us about it. So this deck boat um, has a, a max horsepower of 225 horsepower. Wow. But it runs really well with a 150. It has a... Um, 14 person capacity which is very very uh large for a uh 21 foot boat um yeah. it's got a forward sweeping uh wake tower for wake and water sports uh it's got a table with a rear lounge area the snap-in sea deck throughout it's got a uh fish touchscreen fish finder chart plotter combination that's um, awesome and it's just a very very fast clean comfortable riding boat uh, well, we like fast, we like clean, and we like comfortable. <laughs> I love it, and I, I love how it wraps around. And how is the stereo system? I see speakers everywhere. It bumps. Um, it's got a Fusion uh, Marine Audio stereo system, and uh, it's a uh, it puts on the show. <laughs> yes, it says here it's great size, um, not too small, not too big. It's kind of the in the middle, perfect. The twenty one foot boats are are still manageable to tow and. Um, just operate with, with a few people on board. And where do you have your storage here? Oh, there's uh, under, seats, under seat storage under seats? On, on, on both, underneath both benches on either side. Nice. And then there's a huge compartment in the, in the floor that we were kind of standing on. Oh. Uh, this is an in-floor ski locker. It opens up and you can literally put anything you want in there. 
I love this so much. I really, I was leaning towards a pontoon, guys, but I think this is the way to go. Mm -hmm. And it goes fast and it's safe, so I like it. And tell us about the touch. Is there any touch screen here? There, there, no. there is. We don't have this hooked up, but okay. the screen, uh, chart plotter and fish finder here you so go. you can uh, see where you're going and uh, know, know your depths and navigate safely through the waterways. Thank you so much. I appreciate your time. Now I am torn between the pontoon and the hurricane. <laughs> so stay tuned and we'll let you know what I'm going to buy. Thank you guys. Many have Thank tried. you so much. Yeah, yeah. Okay. None compare to Yamaha's marine engine's unbeatable reliability, durability, and unparalleled performance. Go with the engine that is built on 65 years of marine heritage. And trust your family memories to a legend. Expertly crafted by the number one brand on the water. This month at Highway Marine, get a new Yamaha boat and take advantage of Yamaha's zero, zero offer. That's zero down and zero payments for 90 days or choose 2.99 financing for up to 60 months. In the market for a new Yamaha Wave Runner, the same great zero, zero offer applies. That's zero down and zero payments for up to 90 days or choose 3.99% APR financing for up to 36 months. Highway Marine also has rebates up to $1,500 on Mercury Outboard Motors from 175 to 400 horsepower. Take advantage of these offers and more at Highway Marine in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm your hostess, Sarah Viteri, and we're here at the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show. I'm so happy to be back um, with our second half of our virtual event. Thanks to everyone who signed up to be here in person today. It's great to see you all. And remember, we are having so much fun so please call in because we want to hear from you this year's boat show is filled with lots of exciting activities we've got our expert staff here with our boat tours with our how-to tutorials and we'll also have some exciting boating trivia games so if you know your stuff call in today and maybe we'll give you some highway marine prizes how about that? <laughs> Don't forget, if you want to stop by in person during the rest of the show, head over to hmboatshow.com and fill out our RSVP form. And anyone can watch from your home. So please find the details of the virtual event at hmboatshow.com. And you'll also find the form to enter to win a free e-scooter Explorer. We'll announce the winner on the last day of the show, which is Sunday, March 28th at 3 p.m. during our live show. So don't forget to call in. We still want to hear from you. 570-417-7209. All right. Let's get back to the show. Hi folks, Andy Paradise here. I'm the sales manager at Highway Marine. Wanted to talk to you a minute about COVID safety. Um, we are very sensitive to your safety as well as the employees here at Highway Marine. We do um, have hand sanitizing stations throughout the store and we do require that you mask up when you come in. And we always try our best to uh, have safe social distancing between ourselves and all of our customers. Please come in, we'll make you as comfortable as it can possibly be. Boat lovers, jet ski thrill seekers, open water voyagers, and navigation experts, welcome. We're Highway Marine. We are proud providers of high quality, new and used boats by top rated marine industry brands. With selections from Yamaha, Crestliner, Hurricane, Sea Fox, and Seawater. If you love time spent on the open water, Highway Marine is for you. Whether it's your first time out there or you're a seasoned pro, our 30-person team of boating experts is dedicated to helping you navigate on your next boating adventure. We're a family-owned business focused on perfection in sales, 
service, and customer satisfaction. Highway Marine has a 16-acre facility where we cater to every boater's needs. Our boat repair and service department employs certified technicians with state-of-the-art diagnostic equipment for top-of-the-line boat and motor maintenance and repair, allowing us to easily manage boat hauling, detailing, fiberglass repairs, engine rebuilds, and storage. Our sales department is filled with power boat specialists who are eager to work with your budgeting needs and boating desires. We even have a boat accessories department that is one of the largest in the area providing discounted prices every day. The best part? We have a state-of-the-art showroom with over 35 new and incredible boats to browse. Pay us a visit and join the Highway Marine family of proud owners because you deserve the perfect boating experience. Stop by Highway Marine at 875 Northwest End Boulevard, Quakertown, PA. Visit highwaymarine.com or give us a call at 215 536 4721 to find out more about our incredible services and offerings. You owe it to yourself to see these new and used boats and pontoons firsthand. Welcome back. We're going to give you some more knowledge now. We are here back with Andrew and now we're at the Sea Fox and he's going to show us um, their dual screen and what it all entails and all the technology that we want to learn about. So tell us what makes the dual screen different than the other boats? Um, just having a uh all the information available to you, whether it's it's your chart plotter or your 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 uh, fish finder, um, it gives you your location. It gives you everything, a whole sense of, of surrounding, which uh, equates into safety, um, uh, ease of use, and convenience. There's there's just so many so many benefits to having the twin screens. Uh, I don't even know where to begin. Um, but this boat is packed with uh, electronics. Um, we've got up top here, we've got all kinds of overhead spreader lights and deck lights to light up the boat. We've got a wireless phone charger integrated into this. The ever so popular dual uh, Garmin 10 inch touch screens. Yes. Um, we've got the Yamaha fuel management gauges. Uh, we've got a windlass, so there's no more uh, pulling of that, that heavy anchor um, that will pull it up automatically. And then we've got uh, a really good kicker marine audio sound system in here. There's like a 10-inch powered subwoofer, so this boat really bumps. Um, yes. Through all here, we've got all the, the standard electronic uh, options, the horn, the navigation lights, the bilge pump. Um, this is a fishing boat with a... Um, We've got the aquarium style live well in, in the back, which also illuminates at night. It lights up. Ooh. Uh, there's underwater lighting on this boat, which will is color changing. You can, uh, it just adds okay. a really, really cool uh, dynamic to, to the boat and boating in general. I um, love it. And tell me, tell me about these screens. Uh, show everybody again, the, how it the, works. It's all just simple, sim simple touch screen. Um, you can go to your different waypoints and settings so you can, you can plot a course. Um, you got your home, the screen, so you can have multiple displays going where you've got your charts, your depth, and then we've got ultra high def, um, uh, that looks really cool. Right you can really see, um, the rocks and bottom structure are uh, there on the bottom. That's uh, it, really it's, it's really, really refined. And then over here again, you can have like, uh, oh, let me go back. Where was that? A 3D, you got 3D uh, mapping, so once you plot your course, you get on there and it will literally, uh, you know, it's like, a, uh, it'll tell you where to go. You just follow the map, yeah. follow the on-screen instructions. So uh, the, the ease of use and ease of navigation in this boat is, is bar none. Absolutely. So for even a newbie like me, this would be something Excellent. fairly easy to use. Correct. And, and it is expandable. You can add an, another screen or autopilot or even add radar into the mix so that you've got map overlay. Um, you can get uh, satellite uh, uh, weather radio, uh, NOAA live buoy data. 
Um, just basically all the information uh, that you would need to be uh, a successful mariner. See, now you're making it harder for me. The <laughs> pontoon, we have the hurricane, now the sea fox. Which one do I want? I do love the dual screen and the ease of it. It, it, it seems like it's something great for, especially for when you're it's beginning very, and to be safe. It's very, very intuitive and it's fun to play around with. You, get, yeah. you, you, you can completely customize it to suit your needs. I really enjoy this. And how many people are fit in this boat? This boat has a 10 person capacity. 10 person. Um, again, and Sea Fox is noted for family friendly in the front, fisherman friendly in the rear. Uh, it's just an all, overall great family fun fishing and fun platform. Awesome. And where do you see over here? Can you, I see my diagnostics if you come here? Um, so getting the engine diagnostics is, is a little different story right now because okay. I don't have anything. Um, gotcha. Okay, so, but you can see the diagnostics correct. on here. You, you, can pull, awesome. you can pull up all your, your Yamaha engine data. That's uh, for right me because that. that's really important for me, especially <laughs> in my car. I do that too. I check yeah. it all the time. I want to be safe. It's also quickly Thank you. down here on the Yamaha uh, tech gauges. to show your fuel burn and, and all that. So. Awesome. Andrew, thank you for making my decision harder. I don't know <laughs> what boat now. <laughs> thank you, guys. We will be back at the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show Live. Thanks for coming. <laughs> yes. Welcome to Highway Marine Service Department. Our team employs certified technicians with state-of-the-art diagnostic equipment to service your every boating need. Consider us your authorized go-to boat repair and maintenance facility. Our 15,000 square foot service area consisting of 18 service bays can handle just about any sized repair. We don't stop at new and used boats and pontoons either. So bring in your Mercury outboards, Merc Cruiser stern drives, and Yamaha outboards, and boat trailers too. Our trained technicians will take care of anything from a small job to a complete boat motor rebuild or boat engine replacement. Don't just take our word for it. Highway Marine has won the President's Award numerous times for outstanding customer satisfaction. And we are proud to announce that we are one of 12 dealerships in the world to sit on the Manufacturer Dealer Council Board for Bayliner and Mercury. We love what we do, and it shows in our work. Highway Marine is located in Quakertown, Pennsylvania, but welcomes services of residents of Philadelphia, Reading, and Allentown, as well as Trenton, Camden, and other nearby cities in New Jersey. Stop by if you're in the area or visit highwaymarine.com to learn more about our offerings and services. We hope to see you soon. The power to win every weekend. The sophistication to inspire exhilaration. And the technology to customize every ride. Packaged to create a luxury ride like no other. Introducing the most premium personal watercraft on the market. The 2021 FX Series from Yamaha. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show here in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. Don't forget, we wanna hear from you boat stories, lake stories, fishing stories, or if you wanna answer some trivia questions, call in 570-417-7209. And up here we have... Crystal. Crystal. Thank Hi. you, Crystal, for joining us. And you're gonna play some trivia with us. Yes. She's excited. Um, and how long have you been boating? Oh, I don't know, for about 10 years. 
Oh, so we have somebody who knows her stuff. And have you always been a Highway Marine family? Yes. Oh, and what do you love about them? Oh, I just love the personalities here. They're so friendly walking in the door and they point you right in the right direction every single time. And they're just great people to deal with. You hear that folks? Highway Marine will take care of you. Now let's go on to some trivia questions. All right, are you ready? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first trivia question. What percentage of the personal watercraft market do Yamaha Wave Runners hold? Hmm. 85%? Wow. I mean, uh, from what I'm hearing, that seems to be the most popular brand of Wave Runners, <laughs> but it's 42%. Oh, darn. <laughs> Next question. Oh, um, half. We'll give you some points for that. To which part of the boat does the word gunnel refer to? Gunnel. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> yes. The sides. The sides. Yeah, I didn't know that either. Thank God I have this paper with me, right? <laughs> What are crest liner? Where are crest liners made? Crest liners made. I don't know. Ostega, Minnesota. Oh, Minnesota. <laughs> what right. kind of boat do you do you own? What's the brand? Oh, I don't own. We boat as a family. You know, okay. my my parents own. So. Oh, okay, Yamahas. <laughs> gotcha. And what what's the brand? Yamaha. Yamaha. All right. Let me see if I can find a Yamaha question here for you. Ah, oh, we don't have one. But maybe you know this one. What is a PFD? FD personal flotation device yes they got it. we gotta give her something <laughs> production she got one she got one and you should pass on which side of a slower vessel um that's good to know for folks at home mm, starboard actually it doesn't matter oh, it says it doesn't matter whether you pass right or left just be very safe on the water <laughs> all right thank you so much thank let's give her something you know out there production will see you and we'll hook you up with something <laughs> all right up next we have joanne who is one of the vendors outside serving some delicious goodies while we're here at the 2021 boat show at highway marine come on over joanne Hi, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? Are you enjoying the boat show? Oh yes. I'm excited to have you, I'm excited to try your goodies. So what do we have on the menu? So we have pulled pork, pulled chicken, smoked beer brats that are phenomenal, and then we have a signature sandwich, it's called the Frankenstein. It's our pulled pork, smoked brat, two of our homemade barbecue sauces that are phenomenal, and then it has our homemade coleslaw. Wow, that all sounds delicious, and the food looked delicious as I was walking in. It smelled great. I can't wait till my lunch break because I'll be heading over to you. And what's the name of, of your restaurant? It's called Mad Jay's Barbecue. We're located at 52 East Lawn Road, Nazareth, PA. So stop on by. We're open Friday and Saturday from 12 to 7 and Sunday 12 to 5. And do you guys have a Facebook? Yes, we do. And what's the Facebook? Mad Jay's BBQ. Mad Jay's BBQ. Come check them out. Try their food. I am excited. And would you like to answer one trivia question? Try. Let's try. Let's try. Okay, let's give it a whirl. Let's see. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. Let's see something kind of easy. Okay. What power source was used for the first patent outboard motor? Power say. source. Engine? Uh, gas? Like gas? That's actually a really, really good guess, but it's electric. Oh. And you're not the first one person to get that wrong. I, I was surprised too, because you would think gas, you know, first. Yeah. All right, let's try one more, see if we can get it. Let's see if I can get an easy one here. Okay. Uh, what does one knot equal to in speed mile in miles per hour? One knot is how you determine the speed of a boat, like miles per hour. What does one knot equal to in miles per hour? Take a wild guess. I'm going to say five miles. That's not a bad guess. It's actually 1.51. Oh. Yes. All right. Thank you so much, Thanks. Joanne. I'll go try some barbecue later. Sounds good. And thank you guys for joining us from home and those who are here in person. If you want to participate and win some prizes, call us at 570-417-7209. We will be back shortly with some more fun. Welcome to Highway Marine. Today I am here with Dustin, who's going to give me a little tour of this wonderful showroom. Right here, we're standing in between some really cool looking wave runners. So tell me a little bit about these. 
Yeah, we carry uh, Yamaha's full line of Wave Runners here, um, anywhere from their EX, the VX, to their FX Cruiser line. Okay, that's a lot of VXs. <laughs> <laughs> what is the difference between the different lines? Uh, the accessories that come on them, uh, the size of the unit, uh, some are supercharged, some have reverse, some don't. Supercharged, that sounds like something I want to get on. So which one is the fastest one here? It would be this FX uh, gray and yellow one right here behind you. This one, and it looks really cool too. And how fast does it go? Right about 70 mile an hour. Okay, and with that, that's the one I'm buying. So save that one for me, Dustin. Show me around the rest of this uh, wonderful showroom. Yeah, absolutely. What else do we have? We uh, have a Seafox uh, center console line over here. Okay. Uh, great for uh, offshore fishing. Okay, haven't gone fishing, so you're gonna have to show me around that. <laughs> Um, and what is this here, this black and green boat? This is Yamaha's jet boat. This is a 252X. It's uh, made for uh, wakeboarding, you know, family and fun. Oh, family fun. And why would you recommend this to a family? Um, the biggest thing is it has no propellers and it's, it's great. It doesn't have, draft a lot of water. So safety. Yeah, absolutely. For the kids. Yep. Okay, great. And this lovely gray boat, what is this? This is our Crestliner aluminum fishing boat. Uh, great for any lakes around here, and um, good for fishermen. Great, so you have your fishermen, you have your family fun, you can go fast, you can play around, and then you have some pontoon boats. What do you recommend um, for the pontoon boats? For family, for fun, for it all? Yeah, uh, Godfrey is our pontoon line we sell. Um, they've, they've come a long way. Pontoon boats come a long way in their years. Um, they're great, they have a lot of uh, space. So it's uh, great for um, you know, bringing your family, your pets, all pets. Like that. So it's safe for dogs, which is something I'm interested in because I take my dog everywhere. And from what I hear is you can have a pontoon that'll be easy in the water and ones that will go really fast. Yeah, it's anywhere from 16 to 25 foot. Uh, some have uh, three tunes, so it's a, a tri-tune. Um, a lot more sportier and faster. Okay, that's where I'm headed. And what do we have here, 150 Pro? Yep, that's our uh, Mercury on our Crestliner fishing boat here. It's uh, You can um, do fishing and also uh, pull tubes and uh, have fun with your kids on it. And what's the difference between this one and that one, the other Mercury? Um, it's actually, uh, the Mercury, it's, it's a little different horsepower um, okay. and the size of the boat. Gotcha. Okay, what else? You have a big showroom and with all these boats that you sell i'm sure that at some point they need maintenance do you guys offer that here yeah, absolutely we have an 18 bay service uh area in the back uh we do anything from winterization to your random uh service um okay done for you so you can buy the boats here and then come and get it serviced all under one roof at highway marine um, I just love what you have to offer. You have something for everybody. And I think you have some really luxurious pontoon boats that I want to go check out. So come on, let's go. Yep. We're not going to show you guys. <laughs> <gasps> Look at this. Welcome back to the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show Live. How are you feeling, Scott? I'm feeling good. Feeling great. And you're selling lots of boats, I see. Uh, yes. That's uh, no, uh, yeah, no shortage of sales here. <laughs> so if you want to get on the lake this summer, hurry on by to the boat show. Remember, our last day is Sunday the 28th. So I'm here with Scott, who is going to walk us through this beautiful Sea Fox 248. We went over a little bit of the center console earlier. So tell us some other features, um, where it's made, their amenities, uh, and the styling. Sure. Um, well, first of all, we're going to want to get out of the lake with this boat, because this is a very capable offshore fishing boat. Um, it really is, uh, is meant to be uh, used in the ocean. Certainly okay. larger lakes, um, yeah, not a problem, but it really stretches its legs out in the, uh, in the open water. Um, they are manufactured in South Carolina, hand-built. Um, one of the nice features about Seatbox is what they've been doing over the past few years is kind of making it a boat for the whole family. Okay. Obviously very capable for fishing, and we'll get to that in a minute, but also up here. Um, lounge. Yeah, I see, I see of, my lounge area. Exactly. <laughs> um, so there's a lot of like family-friendly features up around here. Uh, this center cushion uh, is also removable, and it becomes a converts into a table. Oh, great. So but entertaining. 
Um, another cool feature for the family is inside this compartment here, there's a uh, toilet. And oh, it's a, well, an actual that is toilet, important. So not, like a, yeah, not a, not a porta potty. That is so important. You know how many times we ha you have to jump off the boat to go to the bathroom? That is great to know. Yeah, it'll save you, save you <laughs> getting wet. Yep. Yes, thank um, you, especially at nighttime when it gets chilly. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So, um, I mean, if we want to talk about some stuff towards the back of the boat. Let's um, go. Walk yeah, me through the back. Pop through here. And you do have okay. a fairly large cockpit back here um, for fishing, obviously. Um, we have an aquarium style live well. So you I can kinda, saw that, and yeah. they said that it lights up as well? Exactly, yeah. So you can kind of keep keep an eye on your baits throughout the day. Cool. Um, this seal's pretty... Make sure they don't go anywhere. <laughs> exactly, and this seal's pretty tight too, so it keeps them from uh, sloshing around and they're getting damaged throughout the day. I uh, love for it. For catch, there's a fish box down in under this seat here. Also comes with a pretty sturdy cooler. Oh, and that comes with it? That comes with the boat, yeah. That's awesome. And rod storage. There's absolutely no shortage of rod storage on this boat. Um, you have rocket launchers up here, rod storage here, and then storage in the gunnels as well. Um, so like I said, it's a, it's a serious offshore fishing boat. And up to how many people can fish on this boat comfortably? Well, I mean, they tell you that it's a 10 person capacity. That's... Okay. Um, but... You know, it, it really depends on what, what, what you're fishing for. Right, absolutely. Yeah. And you said it's great on the ocean. Yeah, that's what it's meant for. Yeah. Okay, yeah, well, you were... guys, now I know. I wanted to go on the lake. Now I know what this one's for. Yeah. Um, and what else? It has the aquarium live well, mm -hmm. the rod holders, yeah. and 117 fuel tank. Yeah, yeah, it holds a lot of gallons. Um, that's great. You know, it's, it's something that, I mean, depending on where you live and where you do your boating, um, sometimes you do have to take a decent run 20, 40 miles out. Right. Uh, and this will definitely have the capacity to uh, get you there and back. Absolutely. So there you have it, folks. So many features this Sea Fox has. And if you want one, come out today to the Quakertown, Pennsylvania Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show. Thank you so much, Scott. I appreciate all the information. Everyone here knows their stuff. You have the service repair here. We're super excited. So please stay tuned. We have some more coming up for you next. Hi, I'm Randy Vance. I'm on the Sarasota Bay today with the folks at Sea Fox Boats. Now they have completely designed this new 248 Commander from the keel up. This boat not only brings great value to the water, but some amazing features as well. Now the 248's helm station is designed with a three spoke stainless steel that tilts. You've got Yamaha's command gauges above it and a GPS unit by Garmin. We like the fact that you've got these touch keys here to turn on all your electrical functions, but Sea Fox has moved the circuit breakers below to keep them out of the weather. We're blinged up here with a kicker audio system. You've got these nice little areas here to hold small gear and keep them in place, but take a look at the steps below. The bottom one is ideal for the leaning post ride. It's also illuminated with an LED for a soft glow at night. Fold the bolsters down on the seats and use the top step while you're driving. There's even another footrest on the leaning post that folds down to give you yet another option for comfort. Now the hardtop also has LED courtesy lights for a nice soft glow. There's also LED spreader lights to illuminate the deck while you're fishing. The hardtop is designed with four electronics boxes that give you great access to your electronics or any gear you want to stow up there. On the forward part of the hardtop, you've got this great compartment that stows your fire extinguisher, safety flares, and registration papers for your boat. We also like the way the powder coated structure is recessed up against the console to give you wider walkways on either side. Now I like this wide transom seat. It's great comfort when you're cruising out to the fishing grounds. Underneath is your fish box. You've got rod holders in the gunnels on either side along with stainless steel cup holders. Now there's two shotgun rod holders on either side of the removable tow pylon. Step through the transom door and you come to the boarding ladder. The whole area is covered with surf mat. Also lift this hatch and you'll find an insulated cooler that can double as an aft anchor locker. Now you've got even more rod holders thanks to the four in the leaning post. You've got five in the hardtop along with a pair of kingfish rod mounts on the sides. 
One great surprise we found on board the 248 is this pressurized aquarium style live well. You've got an adjustable drain at the bottom and the top, an adjustable inflow, and this great compartment aft of it to keep your bait net. Sea Fox was particularly good at the creature comforts in the 248 Commander. I love these aft facing lounges. You can stay in contact with your entire crew. Sea Fox also gives you a forward facing option. Just flip these bolsters forward. Now you can remove the center cushion and the table for more leg room. Add the table back in for picnicking or put the table down, remove the cushions and you've got a great casting deck for hardcore fishing. Another nice touch is that Sea Fox has recessed all the stainless steel grab rails so they won't interfere with your net or your tackle. In the center of the floor, lift the hatch and you've got storage for your net bucket. There's even more seating on the front of the console and a porcelain head underneath for all day comfort on the water. Now, if you haven't looked at Sea Fox in a number of years, the 248 Commander is a great reason to take another look. We found impressive fishing features, great creature comforts, and a fun ride. This month at Highway Marine, get a new Yamaha boat and take advantage of Yamaha's zero, zero offer. That's zero down and zero payments for 90 days for up to 90 days or choose 3.99% APR financing for up to 36 months. Highway Marine also has rebates up to $1,500 on Mercury Outboard Motors from 175 to 400 horsepower. Take advantage of these offers and more at Highway Marine in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. Many have tried, but none compare to Yamaha's marine engine's unbeatable reliability, durability, and unparalleled performance. Go with the engine that is built on 65 years of marine heritage. And trust your family memories to a legend. Expertly crafted by the number one brand on the water. Hello folks, and we are back here with Andy, and he has some fish tails he wants to share with us, and I can't wait to hear because he has a lots of experience. So tell me, funny story, sad story, should we be scared? Uh, maybe, maybe a little bit of each. Oh no. All right, so tell <laughs> but, us your story. Yeah, the one that really hits home to me, uh, quite a while ago, uh, myself and some of the people from here back in my early days had um, gone out on a 28-foot trophy out of Ocean City, Maryland, and uh, we were going to do some tuna fishing. So we were about 40 miles out, and we landed a huge, Ooh. not really what they call a big eye, but it was a bluefin, and it was a massive, and it was so big, we could not get it on the boat, <gasps> okay? So we had to... How many feet? Uh, the boat, or the, the fish? Oh, it was an easy, it was an easy 9, 10 foot. Uh, tuna, but they're Whoa. more girthy. They're, they're, so we had to drag it next to the boat, which oftentimes happens um, back to the marina, mm. 40 plus miles. So it took us forever to get back. On the way back, we were noticing that this tuna, beautiful tuna, was slowly getting eaten by sharks <gasps> on the way back. And by the time we got back to the dock, there was less than half of the no. fish yeah. So needless to say, we drew a pretty good crowd. And um, Yeah, I bet all those sharks following you yeah. back to the dock. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so it was uh, it was interesting, exciting, a little disappointing, but the, uh, the fight to bring that tuna in had us all exhausted. Oh yeah. my God, well, thank you for that story, <laughs> Andy. Welcome. I do not want to be the people waiting at the dock with all those sharks coming in after you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Andy. And we have someone else who has a fishtail story here who's attending the car, the show, the uh, car show, the auto show. Come on over, Ken. Come on over. <laughs> so, little birdies tell me you have a fishing story to share. Well, I have a few. Oh, okay. Pick one. <laughs> but uh, 
The worst part is I lost my fishing partner this year. Oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, fished at the Thousand Islands for at least 30 years. Oh. My friend, I lost my friend and also my wife. Oh, I'm so, so sorry about but that. We're still going up this year, though. Oh, you are. Well, I am so sorry. I'm glad you had that, those memories of being yes. on the lake with them. We do. And that's what brings you go, brings you back to the lake right. to, to remember them. And, oh, I'm so sorry. But thank you for being here. Are you enjoying the show? Yes. Good, good. Good. good day for a boat show. Good day for a boat show. And what brings you in today? Are you servicing? Are you getting a new boat? I need some parts for uh, my brother. Oh, okay, yeah. great. And that's what they are known for as well as their expertise staff. Lots of service and parts. They're great for that. Thank you so much, Ken. I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> and thank you very much, everyone who has been tuning in. And please call in with them stories. 570-417-7209. And remember, aquí también se habla español. Bienvenidos a Highway Marine. Estoy aquí con Esteban, que nos puede ayudar a todos los clientes que hablan español. Eso sí me encanta para nuestra comunidad latina. Y ahora vamos a hablar de el Wave Runner de Yamaha que tenemos aquí. Cuéntame, ¿por qué te gusta este, este Wave Runner? Pues me gustan los colores, el estilo, muy deportivo, muy divertido. Este, corra muy rápido, pero también puedes poner un gobernador que no se corre tan rápido tampoco. Oh, ok, también. entonces depende si es que estás con niños chiquitos, Así a lo mejor es. quieres, you know, uh -huh. take it easy. Take pero si es que quieres ir súper sí, sí. este, rápido, puedes sacar al gobernador. Sí. Ok, uh -huh. muy bien. ¿Y, cuán, ¿Y qué rápido puedes ir? Pues este como 70, más o menos como 70. 100 kilómetros por hora. Ok, y aquí Más veo que tiene un speaker, parece. Sí. Este, y cuéntame. Eh. Este viene con el, audio, el paquete de audio. Ok. okay. Uh, puedes ordenarlo sin el audio si quieres. Este, pero ahorita están mandando todos con audio. Porque okay. está muy padre el audio. Sí. Puedes conectar, conectar tu teléfono o diferentes entonces cosas. puedes conectar por Bluetooth. Así es. Y no veo dónde puedes poner tu celular si lo conectas pues con Bluetooth. Hay unos, ¿no? hay unos lugares que okay. sí puedes ponerlo, pero afuera no hay lugar porque a lo mejor no quieren que mojas tu teléfono y todo eso. Claro, pero si estamos en YouTube, vamos a necesitar el celular. Y aquí veo en este Yamaha que tiene un accesorio muy bueno para poner su teléfono claro y sí. poner cosas y tenerlos mantenerlos secos. ¿Y esto es un accesorio separado? Separado, totalmente. Oh. Uh -huh. Entonces, este también puedes comprar para claro que el 1800 sí. aquí. Y hay varias accessories que puedes comprar y este, poner y quitar y todo eso. Claro, y puedes escoger si te gusta el blanco, si te gusta el negro y muchas cosas. Así es. Bueno, muchas gracias, Steven, por darme el tour de aquí, de estas beautiful Wave Runners. Me encantan. Y ya saben que pregunten por Steven. Él habla español y les puede ayudar. Aquí estamos a sus órdenes. Welcome back. Have you called in yet? Because we still want to hear from you. Remember, that phone number is 570-417-7209. Fish stories, boat stories. Have you been to Highway Marine? We want to hear your experience. So now we're going to talk to one of the employees that you've seen already in our screen, Andy. Wherever he is, <laughs> but Andy will be joining me soon. In the meantime, are you calling? Because the phones have been ringing. Is it you? 570-417-7209. Make sure you call in. And remember, if you want to get on the lake 2021, come and sign up for the boat show. HM Marine Boat Show. So Highway Marine is in Quakertown, Pennsylvania. You can find them right off 309. Great customer service, service repair, whatever you need, their expert staff can help you out. So please come join us. And remember, our last day for the live is going to be Sunday the 28th, 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. Go online and make sure you sign up to win some cool prizes. We want to hear from you, remember. 
And we have Andy. I think he's hiding somewhere here in the showroom. Well, let me tell you guys, it has been super busy. They're selling boats left and right. So, yeah, so they've been selling boats left and right. So what do you want, what do, you want to do? RSVP. <laughs> Make sure you come over and you RSVP. You come in person or watch us live. Either way, we're going to be here at the 2021 Highway Marine Boat Show. It's been really fun getting to know the people here. They're like a family and learning everything about the boats has been incredible. So thank you for the Highway Marine family for having us here and for teaching us so much. And, uh, and we have Andy. Yes, Andy, come on over. Hello again. Hi, Andy. We've been looking for you left and right, but we okay. reeled him in. <laughs> Andy, thank you so much. How has been your experience so far at the 2021 Boat Show? We're just having an absolute blast. Um, starting on this past Saturday, the show has been incredible. We've sold almost 40 boats at almost a million point Woo! $1,500,000. It's just been fantastic. Now, a lot of the stuff isn't in stock, all right? It's been an amazing year. Last year was incredible. We are completely sold out of Yamaha boats and Wave Runner boats, and we've taken more than a dozen deposits for 2022 models. Wow. Yeah, so and to assure your boat that you're going to have it, that's what you need to do. We have tons of um, boats that are still incoming. Um, okay. Hurricane deck boats, Sweetwater pontoon boats. We have a gaggle of crest liners coming next month. Um, so and all of you bass yeah. fishermen, yeah, come yeah. and see us. RSVP, come through. Remember, Highway Marine, Quakertown, Pennsylvania. Look for them on Facebook and look for them online. So tell us, what is the best part about being a Highway Marine family? Well, it has to be. It starts at the ownership. The Wimmer family has been absolutely fantastic to me. Uh, they started in 1977. I started in 1990, which makes me here 30 years, and I've seen the evolution of the dealership. So it absolutely starts with the owners. But at the end of the day, it's about the customers and their experiences, not my experience with a fishtail or talking about a Yamaha boat. It's their experiences. And with how long I've been here, I've seen people come in buying boats having children now their children are old enough to buy boats and they've started this yeah they've started this legacy in their family and it just goes on and on and on and, and apart from the boats and the service center you have fabulous accessories here tell us about all these accessories what you can customize your boats you can absolutely customize it. And um, there's not a lot of boat stores around that have accessories like this. I mean, every every dealer and every marina has all the knickknacks. They're gonna have your life jackets and your rod holders and stuff. But when you come in here, you can really find what you need. And the best part about it, if we don't have it, we can order it and it'll be here the next day. Thank you so much. Andy's always with the information. <laughs> I'm going to come back just to talk to you after the boat show. <laughs> Thank you guys for tuning in. We still have some more stuff coming up. Don't forget, we want to hear from you. Call us today. Hi, I'm Adam Carlson over here at Highway Marine. Today I'm on a 2021 Yamaha 252 X boat, but I'm going to go over how to clean out the cleanout ports of any obstructions. This works with all Yamaha boats. If you feel like you have a loss of performance or you might have a clog, you're just going to find a safe spot to stop, shut off the motors, come to the back of the boat, lift up on your latch, turn it clockwise, and then you can lift up on the hatch. You'll reach down into the hole, push down firmly, and rotate counterclockwise. You'll feel a click, and you can lift it out. Put it to the side. Then you can reach down and feel for any obstructions that might be around the drive shaft or impeller. Remove them. Periodically, you'll take Vaseline, spread it around the large O-ring and lips of the cleanout port. This will extend the life and it will function much smoother and easier. Look at the top of your cleanout port. You'll see the word set. Line up the black tab with that and face it towards you. Drop it back into the hole. Give it away. You feel it seat down, push down hard and rotate clockwise. You'll feel a click. Lift it a few times. If it doesn't come out, you're good to go. You want to make sure the door is fully closed as there's an engine safety there. Rotate counterclockwise and push down. And just like that, you're ready to go boating in less than a minute.
Welcome back. And we're here with Scott, who is going to tell us a little bit more because like I said, they have expert staff. But while we're sitting here, make sure you call in with any questions because these guys will help you out. 570-417-7209. Questions, comments, concerns, we're here to help. So we're here with the Yamaha Outboards and there's so much great things to point out about them. Their warranty, their horsepower. Tell us a little bit about them. Yeah, so uh, as far as uh, outboard motor goes, uh, Yamaha is, uh, is pretty much the benchmark in the industry. Um, they do come with a three-year warranty right out of the box. Uh, horsepower ranges from two and a half horsepower all the way up to 425 for some of your... Uh, That's a big jump. Uh, so uh, <laughs> how do you make those decisions? Well, it's really based on the size of your boat. I mean, your, your larger motors, 300, 250, 300, 425. Yeah. Those are going to be for mainly uh, your offshore Okay. Uh, off offshore applications. Um, it is, it would be, in my opinion, the only model, the only brand to uh, go with if you're going to be doing offshore fishing with them. Um, their, their reliability, their power is, uh, it's absolutely second to none. There you go. If you want to go two miles per hour, get a Yamaha outboard. If you want to go 400, get a Yamaha outboard. <laughs> Everything in between. And tell us about the V6 models. So the V6 models, those are going to be uh, your uh, your larger offshore motors, like I said. Um, they are 17% more fuel efficient than uh, they previously were. And uh, also 19% um, more, uh, more speed available to you. Um, right. A lot of these, a lot of, uh, I mean, if you go down to uh, any marina next time you're at the beach, Take a look at what's on the back of those boats and more than likely it's going to be a Yamaha. I know that that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be looking at the motors after talking to all these experts. And we have a little guest here. This is Georgia, the resident puppy. Georgia loves boats. She prefers pontoons, she told me earlier. Um, and tell us about the 300 plasma infused sleeveless cylinders. It's a... Uh it's a manufacturing technique that Yamaha came up with. It, uh, it, it once again, it just adds adds to the uh, the efficiency. Um, obviously, things that are running smoother are going to operate better. better. Exactly. So <laughs> smoother equals so better. <laughs> a lot of that technology is uh, above my pay grade, um, but it's uh, it's been proven to uh, to really increase performance and the overall durability. And when it comes to Yamaha, durability and, and reliability are the two uh, two biggest factors. Thank you so much, Scott. So come out here, see Scott, see Andy, see Andrew, see Georgia here at the Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show. Yamaha's reputation for saltwater reliability is driven by the 4.2 liter V6 Offshore's 97% reliability and overall performance. Reimagined with new advantages like built-in digital electric steering for incredible responsiveness and exhaust rerouting for more powerful reverse thrust, the legacy of the reliable Yamaha 4.2 liter V6 continues, now more refined and capable than ever. Yamaha, reliability starts here. And welcome back. As I said, we have some expert staff, and right now we have Joe here with us, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about this Superhawk. Mm -hmm. Tell us all the features. Sure. Well, the, the, the Superhawk line from Crestliner is a deep V boat. It comes in a 17, 18, and 19 foot version. The Superhawk is kind of like the perfect compromise between a really hardcore fishing machine Okay. In a very family friendly boat. For instance, performance wise, it has the APX hull, which has a recessed pad, which funnels, which funnels water 
undisturbed to the propeller. It's going to give you more bite. It's mm. going to give you more torque, better top end speed, and you'll get on plane faster. There's seating in the cockpit for up to six people. The back deck has two jump seats that fold up and flip down, and they surround the live well, which is a fishing feature. Mm. There's also, also four movable pedestal seats in the center of the boat. You can move those to a position uh, here on the back. Yeah, and I see them kind of folded up. It's, it's customizable, I see. Yeah, you can kind of rearrange them a little bit. Mm -hmm. There's only two more pedestal slots. There's one on the front of the boat. So if you had, let's say, a trolling motor in the front, electric motor, you wanted to sit down in the front while you fish, you could move one of the seats from the cockpit area up front. There's also, wow. there's also awesome. one of those back here at the stern in case you wanted to fish in the back. You want to go to the front of the boat, you want to go to the back of the boat, doesn't matter. Here you can do it, folks. I love that. Mm -hmm. And what else are the features? How fast does it go? What are the safety features? Well, um, like, like most boats, um, safety features you have to have on it would be a, a horn or some form of audible device. Um, it has a bilge pump, so you could pump out any water that might get in the boat from rain or, or maybe some chop on the water. Some family-friendly features I want to point out on yes. this boat, two that we can actually see directly behind us. See, right above that outboard, there's a silver ski pylon. Okay. So if you want to enjoy water sports, let's say you want to tow a tube, for instance, you tie your rope directly to the top of that. Okay. And that's actually removable. You just twist it out. It's a two-position latch. Then you can store it in you case see. you wanted to, you know, troll for some salmon or trout off the back. Gotcha. Okay, so you can do both. You can lay in your tube or you can fish, be mm -hmm. more active on this boat. Yes. I love that. Now, does it come in different colors? It does. If you were to go on the Crestliner's website, you'll see a variety of colors that they have. We have this one in particular painted with white and black. They come in, uh, you know, gunmetal gray. They come in silver. They come in all white, uh, red, blues. And there's a couple ways that you can... Uh, that, that you can kind of custom build your own Crestliner. In fact, oh, if, I like that. If any customers were interested in this particular model with maybe a few other features, a few different features, different colors, you can come on in to us uh, sometime over the next week or so. We'll be able to build you out and spec you out a 2022 model. I really love that because I know it is important for a lot of people to customize. They want to make it their own. They want to stand out in the water. So that is really good to know. Mm -hmm. And tell us, how are you enjoying the Highway Marine Boat Show so far? I'm having a great time. You are? There's something about the smell of a boat showroom that gets me up smiling in the morning. I know, and it's been really busy. You're selling out. Everybody keeps talking about the inventory just being almost non-existent for 2021. Yeah, the 2021s have, uh, demand has been really, really, inventory is getting low. We do still have some more boats incoming. So all hope is not lost. Mm. I would suggest if anybody is looking to get on the water sooner than later, you might want to consider shopping around, reserving yourself a 2022. There uh, you go. Just come in and talk to us about your options. We'd probably be able to help you. So, guys, it may not be too late. So come on through the Highway Marine Boat Show 2021. We are in Quakertown, Pennsylvania, right off 309. An easy shot off anywhere if you're coming from philly if you're coming from lehigh valley we are here for you thank you so much for all your expert advice and for showing us around the showroom we are still here and we're still taking your calls 570-417-7209 boat stories comments concerns or you want to ask one of our experts something call us in
Hi guys, welcome back to the Quakertown, Pennsylvania Highway Marine 2021 Boat Show. Remember, we are still here to the 28th and we will be back here live between 2 p.m. and 4 p.m. So thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate the people that were watching us from home, the people that came and visited us in person. We appreciate you both. Remember to come in person, but you must RSVP so you can come and explore the boats. Remember, you wanna get on the lake, you wanna come as soon as possible. You should visit at hmboatshow.com. That's where you can RSVP and register for the grand prize giveaway. So we will be announcing the winner of the Yamaha Sea Scooter on the 28th at 3 p.m. during our final live show. So if you wanna get your boat story heard, you wanna register to win a prize, remember to call us 570-417-7209 and register to come in person for the boat show. Thank you. Appreciate everyone's time. This is your host, Sarah Viteri, and I'm signing off until next time.